Well, I've just disembarked from British Airways' first Airbus A380, freshly delivered from Toulouse. And to find out a little more about what British Airways plans to do with the aircraft, as well as its newly delivered 787, we talked to the Chief Executive, Keith Williams. So this a first A380 that you see today enters into service in the middle of September, September 24. There's a second delivery which comes in October and a further delivery this year. What you'll see over the winter is we'll add a little bit of capacity through the gauge of this aircraft and it gives us long term the opportunity to replace the 747 fleet. So the initial route is Los Angeles. Um, so the aircraft starting on September 24th is going to Los Angeles. You've then got a flight to Hong Kong. So what you're seeing is put the aircraft on the thicker trunk routes at the beginning. And over time, you know, we'll look for when we get the other A380s, we've got 12 in total to come to, come to British Airways. They will fly to constrained routes across the network. Yeah, what you see is, is going from a full Boeing fleet into a mix of Airbus and Boeing. So with Boeing, we've got delivery of the new 787s. With Airbus, we've got the A380s today and subject to shareholder approval later in the year, you should see approval to get some A350s. So it'll be a mixed fleet going forward. So the 787 will do some short haul flying initially, and then the first flight for the 787 will be Toronto, and the second one will be to Newark. So, uh, you know, all new ventures for British Airways. So one of the things we have at British Airways going forward is the, with the addition of additional slots through BMI, we can start new routes and the 787s, 787-8s are ideal for the new route network that will be flying in the future. So there you have it, new aircraft, a new era for British Airways. For Flight Global at London Heathrow, I'm David Kaminsky-Morrow.